Special thanks to EA for the early complimentary copy of Mass Effect Andromeda. Oh, hey, Pathfinder. <gasps> the Pathfinder's there? Let me say hi. Fine, but don't embarrass me. Ryder, this is Sid, my sister. Sid, Ryder. Let me guess. Little sister? Who are you calling little? Look, kiddo. Gotta go. Wait, Ryder, I just wanted to know if... So I know it feels like I just jumped aboard your ship without explanation? I would have done the same just to get off the Nexus. That's not why I came. Sure, I want to explore the galaxy, but I'm really here to work. I know everyone on the crew, even the actuators Gil prefers for the ship. Better, I know how to get my hands on them. With me around, your crew's going to be at their best. We've been failing for months, Ryder. Now that we have you, we have a chance out here. Wow, that's some laser focus. Yeah? Was it too much? Some people get intimidated. We need that sort of drive. I just hope I can keep up. You'll keep up. And I promise I won't tell if you don't. I should track down a lead for Gil's actuators. Back channels, you know. We'll chat later. Woke up today and thought, back to the search. And then I remembered, it's over. It's really over. We did it. I know what you mean. I don't want this high to go away. I'm going to enjoy it for as long as it lasts before I settle down. Settle down? Yeah, now that we're back on track, I thought I'd maybe talk to a Nexus colonization expert. Get assigned to an outpost, start a farm or something. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I love being on the ship. I'm staying here until you kick me off. Have anyone else here with you? Besides Sid? No, just me and Sid. It's always been just the two of us. No, I mean... someone special. Special? Oh. You mean like... Oh. <laughs> no, nothing like that. Who has time? What about you? Anywhere's gonna feel empty if you don't have someone to share it with. A romantic? I wasn't expecting that. Then again, the entire idea of leaving everything you know for a chance at something new is kind of romantic. Um, anyway... You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. Reading up on the Archon spy? If there's one spy, maybe there's more. I'm putting the word out. Maybe we can get one talking. I just want an edge on those Ket bastards. If they ever got their hands on Sid, I'd... Well, imagine if it was Sarah. Sarah's old enough to take care of herself. I still feel my sister's my responsibility. I'm all she has. Sid was so little when our father left, and I was... Well, her age now. You raised your sister by yourself? That can't have been easy. Had to. I waited forever for our father to come home. He never did. He was involved with some bad things. Bad people. Eventually it caught up to him. There was nowhere to run. Not like a whole new galaxy. Is that why you came here? When you're young and stupid, you make bad decisions. Piss off the wrong people. That sort of thing never goes away. Not for you, not for the ones you care about. I don't want to not come home one day. Come on, you're strong. Smart. It'll take a lot to keep you from coming home. Strong, smart, but maybe just lucky. Luck runs out on you. I won't. I have a good feeling about you, Ryder. I should get back to work. Talk to my people, see if they've heard anything. Chat later? Good that you're here, Ryder. I found something while monitoring comms for the Nexus. Multiple attacks by people called the Three Sabers. They're hitting outposts and supply vessels. The really weird part is they seem aware of our operations, like they're getting intel. What are you saying? That someone's feeding them info? Maybe. It would be really bad if that were true, right? I've reported it, and they say they'll investigate, but then forget. But you're the Pathfinder. If someone's betraying the Nexus, you have to do something about it. If they seem to know our operations, that could spell trouble. 
Best to get to the bottom of it. Thank you. I knew I could count on you. Best Pathfinder ever. I don't know where they hide, but I got the nav points for their most recent raids. Maybe the Tempest scanners can figure out where they went. Hey, Ryder. Got an encrypted message from Sid. She has news and wanted to talk to us both. Connecting the call now. Finally! I've been waiting for hours! So you want to tell us what this is all about? I was listening to outpost updates and caught a message about settlers going missing. That doesn't sound good. Yeah, because it's not. They were kidnapped. I dug around, and I think I know where they've been taken. A cave on a moon in the Ramav system. Originally an Angaran mine, I think, but they abandoned it. I don't believe the planet you're talking about is a moon. Whatever. What did I tell you about getting involved? I couldn't just do nothing. How do we know your intel's even reliable? It's reliable. I trust your sister, and there's no sense in wasting time. See? That's a Pathfinder. Sid, just give us everything you have on this. Already done. Could I come along? I want to help. <sighs> you know the answer to that. Right, of course. Stay away from bad people, guns, bombs, Krogan beer. You did good. I just want you to be safe, okay? Yeah, yeah. Bringing us in. Looks like no one's home. I swear if Sid sent us on a pointless search, I'm going to drill her shin plates. Move! Go! <laughs> What the hell was that? Did I land on you? Sorry. Ah, Nyx. So good to finally meet you. And you brought friends. That's even the Pathfinder, if I'm not mistaken. My bait worked better than expected. The missing settlers. Who are you? Why are you kidnapping innocents? Innocents? <sighs> They're criminals. You helped them get away from me. You think I'm gonna let that go? Get comfortable. You'll be here a while. Case of mistaken identity? I'm just as lost as you are. It's okay, Vetra. You don't have to cover for us. That was Meriwether. She runs a smuggling ring on Kadara. We worked for her. Vetra helped us get out of it. New lives, hiding in the outposts. So you're helping people. There was no need for all that modesty. It's not modesty. I didn't help anyone. Okay, okay. You didn't help anyone. I'm getting out of here. We've tried. There's no way out. There's always a way out. Who wanted you involved? Sid, what do we have coming up? Sid? Uh, looks like... Sid? I think... I think someone found my shuttle. I can hear. I think I gotta... Oh no! Sid! Sid, come in! They found her. They're gonna kill her! Why'd you have to go be the hero, Sid? Stupid. So, so stupid. It's better to try to be a hero than do nothing. If trying gets her killed, I'm gonna kill her. You know what I mean. I think I can trace Sid's signal. Should take us to her. No time to waste, but we have to be careful. They have my sister. Watch out! They're coming straight for us! Nix, you come to me. Help!
think carefully about your next move, Pathfinder. That explodes, it takes you out too. You won't let that happen. Petra. It's going to be okay. We're gonna get you out of this. Come on. That's a kid you got there. She's not a threat, let her go. She hacked my security. She's as tall as you are. Guns on the ground. Are you all right? Are you hurt? I... I think I'm okay. Help's on the way. We're all good, thanks to you. <sighs> I didn't mean for any of this. I'm sorry, okay? You can't just mess around with people from Kadara. They're dangerous. I just... These guys wanted to start over, not be exiles anymore. No one else was giving them a chance, so I thought... I can do that. I can help. These are good people who made bad choices. Your sister did the right thing. She still should have talked to me. I don't want you hurt. There are ugly sides to what I do, and you shouldn't have to deal with them. You started out when you were my age, and you managed okay? That wasn't by choice. You saw what we did here. This isn't all fun and games, Sid. Yeah, I was shocked at first, but I understand now, and I can handle it. I don't want you to have to. Whatever. I'm going back to the Nexus, like you wanted. That was intense. Are you all right? Fine. I just need some time to think. Hey, at least the settlers are safe. Thanks for helping me out with this rider. Can we just get moving now? Picking her up. Where to next, Pathfinder? The story about the Thresher Moor again. The one I killed with my... Damn it, Sid. What's going on? I get influence with power players, only to have it squandered by a sister calling in favors under my name. Do you know she got the genome for... Oh, what is it? Cats. Pulled from storage. One, there's no place to grow anything right now. Two, it seems they aren't even a food. So why? Lots of people love cats. They make them happy. I don't think we're in a position to put amusement over necessities. She just doesn't think. Tries to help everyone, damn the consequences. And she thinks what we do is so exciting, but doesn't really understand what it takes. Because what we do is exciting. We make people's lives better. You make it sound so wonderful. We see some real shit. But we don't quit. Because what we do matters. It does, doesn't it? Even on the worst days, knowing we make a difference. To make a difference is probably all Sid wants. But what if she gets herself into another mess? What if she gets hurt? She'll have you to watch her back. I hate it when you're right. She's going to go her own way, no matter what I do. If she does it without my help, she'll run into even worse trouble. Thanks for helping me with this. I swear, my sister isn't going to drag us into an ambush again. Still thinking about the Turian Ark, Mason and Avidus. I hope Avidus is doing all right. After losing someone like that, can anyone ever be all right? 
I hope he... What did Dad used to say? Looks to those who look to him, and together, be uplifted. Wow, I can't believe I remembered that. I was curious about you and Sid, being on your own from such a young age. Yeah, I really wouldn't recommend it. How did you keep you and your sister afloat? I was barely more than a kid myself, so lots of unskilled work. Construction jobs. No one else would do the dangerous stuff, so I would. Being up high, crawling under things. I could shoot a gun, so eventually I moved into smuggling. Even more dangerous, but lucrative. We were never rich, but we got to comfortable. Where was home? Palavin? No, we'd already left Palavin by then. Whatever our dad was involved in meant we weren't welcome there. I hadn't even gone to boot camp yet. Sid was barely a year old. We eventually settled in a mining colony in the Minos Wasteland. Two years later, our dad was gone. Where was your mother in all this? Back on Palavin, I suppose. She was an awful person. All she cared about was climbing the ranks. She and my dad fought all the time. I think at the end they hated each other. When things were really tough, I thought about going back. But she wouldn't have accepted us. Whatever my dad did destroyed any chance of that. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. You realize that even if I do find it, it's gonna cost you. And you know I'm always true to my word, so just get it done. Do you feel it? People aren't as scared of the Ked as they used to be. They used to be terrifying, faceless, but we got the Archon. Now everyone knows they're not so tough. Didn't sound like you were discussing Ked over comms when I walked in, though. Wasn't. I have a friend keeping a lookout for a lamp. One brought from home, but stolen in the revolt. I didn't think you were so sentimental. I'm not the only one. Suvi has her father's antique instruments. Cora, her Asari prayer book, and Liam has the junk that Liam collects. These things are important. They remind us where we came from. I know what you mean. I never want to forget what I left behind. Even as we look forward to the future. Yes. So what's so special about this lamp? It's awful. It's got a butt naked Asari for the stand and she's holding a moon. One of your prized possessions is a really ugly lamp? The foreman at my first job had this lamp. When he was mean, I'd focus on it so he wouldn't see me upset. Now I keep it so I remember where I started. Most of my life was doing stuff to survive, taking shit from assholes or being one. I don't have to do that anymore. I can start over. Something honest. Do you really want to start over? After everything you've been through? I don't know. The point is, I have the choice of changing if I wanted to. For a while, I didn't care that I'd lost the lamp. Everything was a mess and it just didn't matter. But we've made progress, Ryder. Small things matter again. People are daring to dream. It's nice seeing you like this. I know. I like being able to let go and do something for myself for once. Let's hope this is just the start, huh? You were right. The view is great from up here. We're not even to the top yet. Come on, I'll race you. And no jump jets. We're doing it the old-fashioned way. What do I get if I win? What would you like? The bad guy defeated, a magic sword, and the girl. Good thing you're losing then. I don't have a magic sword. Having fun? You look like you're having fun. Scott. 
Is this real? Yeah, I think the sky's real. No. This. How you are towards me. It's like you... care more than a friend. I don't mind if it's no. I just want to be sure it gets messy otherwise. I do care about you. More than a friend. Really? I didn't want to assume. Seems so unlikely. Me, you. And how's that for proving it? I'm convinced. Hey, Ryder, you busy? I've got a surprise for you. Vetra? Sorry, this way. Watch your- Ow! Shins. Can I open my eyes now? Okay, just a little more. Good. Open. Surprise. This is wonderful. I... I tried. It wasn't easy to get all this together, but... You're worth it. I made it for you myself. It's steak. Cow. Earth cow? It just said cow on the packet. Does it matter? Mmm. Delicious. I love cow. I'm going to take time to savor this. You don't have to be nice about it. I know I probably made it wrong. Vetra, this is great, but you didn't have to. I just wanted to do something special for you. As thanks. Finding Meridian, building us a home, that was you. You care about my sister, you care about me. For me. Not because you can get something out of me. I love you. I just don't want to ruin it. I thought... Nothing's ruined. It would take a lot to ruin this. Really? Because I love you too. I think I know how to make all this up to you. Please, no more food. No. I think you'll like this. Mm.